As an elite athlete trying to finish in the money or get that last couple minutes out, you are constantly under the microscope, constantly looking at yourself. Every workout you're going, oh, should I have done more? Could I have gone faster? Why didn't I feel quite right? All those things are in question. Training's pretty much constant. From the second I'm waking up to the second I'm going to sleep, training is what I'm worried about. I know my body is ready for peak performance when I'm mentally good, I'm physically good, and my blood is good. I'm ready to go. I really like using the ember because it is simple. You put it on your finger like you might put on a ring, you wait 90 seconds, and you get a reading. Nothing to it. It doesn't really compare to getting your blood drawn. I've been using Ember device for the past three months and measuring my hemoglobin at first of day and at night. Also measuring it before and after workouts and before and after hydration. The biggest reason to train at altitude is it, it gives you a little extra boost in your blood. Up until now, it was really hard to validate the changes in your blood. So having Ember and showing what my hemoglobin is, now those things will correlate to what I'm doing training-wise. The first time I did high altitude training without the Ember device, I wasn't really sure what to expect. I couldn't really quantify if I had really made any gains. But with the Ember device, I got to see about two weeks in, I started seeing my hemoglobin numbers. They had been on a consistently upward sloping trend. So it was, it was really satisfying to know I had some real improvement that I can measure. I am definitely getting something out of the high altitude training and Ember has really helped me confirm that. Ember will definitely allow any athlete to train smarter. You're getting that constant feedback you, you would never get. When I would spend time at altitude prior, I got those quarterly blood tests. It was the only way I could check whether or not the altitude was making a difference. Two or three months is a long time to wait to figure out whether you're going in the right direction. With Ember, you're 90 seconds away at any time. Any moment, you're 90 seconds away from getting a definitive idea of where you're at. I think that Ember can really show athletes what they're doing right and what they're doing wrong. Any sort of data gives you a competitive advantage because it allows you to look at things retrospectively. So you can see, I did something, it didn't work. I did something and it worked. And you can go back and replicate those things. I think technology is changing the way elite athletes train overall. I'm excited with the Ember device to have definitive data on the differences in my body day to day based on being at altitude. I have never had that before. In endurance sports and for any athlete, confidence is the biggest factor. And as we have more and more data, if we get the data going in the right direction, that gives an athlete confidence. And when I'm confident, I race well.